Nutnik, standing here at the edge of the forest near Knobshire. Um, I'm at the scene of what appears to be a mass murder or some other type of mayhem. Earlier today, uh, three unidentified bodies, uh, decapitated bodies, were found uh, just lying in the leaves near here. Authorities speculate that the victims' heads were removed with um, a probably a chainsaw or some other similar sharp object. Um, at this point in time, the authorities say that they they do not have a suspect. However, there is a person of interest. Uh, the local residents reported that a man wearing a blue ski mask, the uh, pull-down type ski mask that um, uh, sub-zero temperatures often uh, occasionally uh, people who uh, rob convenience stores. Uh, anyways, it was that type of ski mask and uh, this individual also was wearing a orange uh, windbreaker that was covered with um, some kind of um, a red liquid, uh, so they're thinking possibly blood. Um, and uh, this man was in the, uh, the local tavern, the Night Owl, uh, and uh, he appeared to be very happy. Uh, according to the bartender, um, the man was uh, very pleased and he was uh, talking about how he had earlier made a, he had made a killing earlier in that day. And uh, the bartender, uh, Pepe Rodriguez, just assumed that the man was uh, uh, referring to some kind of financial transaction. Yeah, I didn't know he was some kind of a mass murderer. You know, if I would have known that, I would have kicked him out of here right away. We don't put up with that stuff here at our bar. If you should happen to see this man, please do not confront him. Contact the police as soon as possible. Although there is no evidence linking this person to the uh, crime, uh, police are, are still um, advising people to uh, take extreme caution when they're out uh, frolicking in the woods or strolling or hunting or, uh, you know, holding in the It really only hurts when I laugh. <laughs> oh.